Go, ladies and gentlemen. Woo! That. Yes, yes. Keep it going. Keep it going. Keep it going. Wow, wow, wow. We. Wow, I love the energy, guys. That was Young Kakao by BWCC, which is uh, Breakthrough Worship Community Church. And today we've got the singer songwriter here with us. Please, ladies and gentlemen, give another round of applause. Help me welcome Rio. Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. Hello, hello. hello. Selamat datang, Rio. Terima kasih. Yes, I'm so happy to have you here. Terima yeah. kasih kerana sudi datang dan uh, accept our invitation to yeah. uncover. It's a privilege for from our church as well. Thank you. Aww. Thank you. How are you feeling? Apa perasaan anda after performing that song? Just now, uh, uh, feeling surreal. Like, yeah, I remember how I wrote it uh, mm. last time. How it's the the feeling and so on. Yes, and then even though we just do acoustic, uh, we just like give give all 
give all out to it you Betul. know sing and you know play music yeah you know, sangat like bagus <laughs> now before we start can i just tell you guys that uh, rio you are from Sabah. There we yeah. go. Which part of Sabah? Uh, small town called Tenom. Tenom. Yeah. Oh, nice, nice. So yes, I will try my best. Uh, I got <laughs> A plus in SPM untuk bahasa Melayu saya, so I can, so I can cuba. Boleh, uh, boleh, boleh. Tapi tolong saya juga lah. Yes, yes. <laughs> and and uh, kamu tolong saya in English as well. Boleh, boleh no problem. <laughs> boleh, ba, boleh, ba. Okay, <laughs> first of all, we're just going to get straight down to business. Young Kekal, right? Mm-hmm. It's such a happy song. It's such an uplifting song, you know. Yeah. Uh, masa kamu terang, um, you know, you were singing tadi, you know, mm-hmm. and I, I was behind there and I was mm-hmm. also jumping yeah. and I was like tepuk tangan juga because I feel it's such a happy song, you yeah, know. Yeah. Uh, so maybe we can start by sharing with us. Apakah inspirasi di sebalik lagu Yang Kekal? Okay, inspirasi uh, di sebalik Yang Kekal. Yeah. Uh, if it's from Bible base, uh, kita mm. ada, boleh saya bacakan? Yeah, okay. please. Uh, bilangan 6, mm. bilangan 6. Uh, ayat 24 hingga 26 mm. uh, yang uh, berbunyi begini Tuhan memberkati engkau dan melindungi engkau mm. Tuhan menyinari engkau dengan wajahnya dan memberi engkau kasih karunia Tuhan menghadapkan wajahnya kepadamu dan memberi engkau damai sejahtera mm. jadi uh, I don't know about I think most churches uh, kebanyakan church ada sesi benediction yeah. yeah and then when benediction is usually Pastors or leaders they will pray mm-hmm. so that congregation boleh balik yes. uh, diberikan uh, prayer untuk berkat dan sebagainya. Mm-hmm. Sebenarnya saya terinspirasi daripada that moment actually when my pastor say this firman Tuhan mm. and then I was like why not just put it into a song macam tu. Wow. So that's why if you listen to the early part it says ku dicipta seturut rupamu Uh, I was made in God's image. Mm. Sinariku dengan wajahmu. Uh, shine me with your face or shine me uh, uh, with your face. Yes. Something like this. Then uh, itulah permulaan inspirasi daripada lagu ini. Yeah. Wow. It's just like uh, it's not really amazing, mm. but I believe that sometimes God just use the simple things in your life yes. to make it like uh, if it's for His glory and it is for Him. Yes. Yeah. Beautiful. Fantastic. <laughs> yeah. Ya, yeah, sebab kita pun you know, selalu dengar uh, firman Tuhan dan yeah, yeah, bilangan yeah, 6, 20, uh, ayat 24, yeah, 24 ke 26. Yeah. It's a very common like, yes. untuk memberkati the congregation. Yes. Selalu pastor akan, you know, yeah. uh, yeah. you know, may his face, uh, let the Lord's face turn yes. upon you, may mm-hmm. his face shine upon you. Betul-betul. It's a very common one. So, I'm so glad you were using <laughs> such a you know simple moment. Tapi, uh. di sebaliknya, you can write a beautiful song out of it. Yes. Now, Rio, I, I need to ask you this mm. as well, you know, because mm. sometimes, you know, the, um, dalam process penulisan lagu right mm. uh, some people they go through a breakup some people they're really heartbroken and then they mm. write a song that is very very sad mm. or some people they go through a, a, a high time in their spiritual mm. walk and they encounter God's love and then based on that encounter they they mm. get inspired to write a song mm. uh, Rio ingat tak apa what stage of life Rio masa tu you said you heard this mm. ayat and you know, it really uplift your spirit mm. but what stage of life were you in when you wrote Yang Kekal okay uh It is a continuation of the, my first answer. Mm. So basically, selepas saya dapat ayat ini, mm. and then I was thinking to God, like, uh, what I can do for God after I know this this real things that God speak to me. Mm. And then uh, during that time, uh, saya ingat saya mula baru bekerja, mm. still working because uh, I've been in KL studying and so on. Mm. And then actually, I'm going through some tough times in terf- in terms of What's next? Mm. I think uh, young adults can resonate Banyak. with me. Yeah. Uh, like after you finish your study, what next? What you want to do? Mm. So from through this song, actually, it reminded me to like, uh, you know, your life is a calling. Mm. So itu uh, ku berserah pada panggilanmu. Yeah. Ini jiwa dan hatiku. Mm. Ku abadikan segalanya. Kau yang kekal untuk selamanya. So you like invest something that is forever. Mm. This you invest something yang yang kekal untuk selamanya. Mm. So At that stage, I can say saya punya iman itu uh, is not shake is not shaken, bukan shaken, tapi lebih to affirm back, mm. reminded that God has a plan for me, God yeah. has a promise for me, wow. and then I hope that uh, bila saya tulis ni, I just imagine the congregation when they sing it, they also have that same faith as me. Wow. So that's the stage of faith during that time. 
I love it, Rio. <laughs> Very good. Now we yeah. mentioned Rio, Rio, Rio a lot of times, and we were talking yeah, sebelum yeah. kita hit record yeah, tadi yeah, kan. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, said yeah. Brandon, you will be quite shocked if you hear my full name. <laughs> so I've got to take a little pause here because okay. I really, really, I'm dying to know, bro. The okay, suspense is killing sure, me. Sure. <laughs> What is Rio's uh, nama penuh anda? Okay. Uh, so uh, shout out to my father. <laughs> okay. <laughs> By giving me this name, uh, to be honest, I have some tough time to like, uh, uh, you know, untuk dap, uh, boleh faham kenapa dia bagi nama tu. Okay. Tapi I know now already. Uh. So okay, it's, it, it is like this: Esario, Estracio, Esar. Huh? Es- <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Sekali lagi, sekali so, lagi. Esario, Esario, Estracio, Estracio, Esar. Esar. Esar is my father's name. The name sounds like a Portuguese or a Spanish yeah. name or something like depending depending on yeah, yeah I, I I I heard words uh, my my students say teacher you're from Mexico ah, you're yes, from yes. Philippine uh, Filipino you're from Brazil uh. so now I know my why my father gave me can the I, name can you so that I can ice breaking with my students ah uh. okay okay <laughs> so okay so like ice breaking okay do you, uh, guess my name from which country I am and mm. then they will like, start giving oh. me countries that even. I don't know it's existing. <laughs> Wait, yeah. do you have any abang adik or not? Yeah, I have two sisters. What? Two sisters. What? Uh, is their name also sangat sangat fancy macam ni atau? Ah, uh, not really lah. Not really. I think, I think Only you, your one is the most. Wow. Uh, so thank you so much for allowing me to just call you Rio. Yeah, yeah. That's Kalau right. tak, uh, <laughs> yeah, interview ni akan sangat panjang. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Now I wanted to ask you as well. You know, what mm. is the? Is it based on life or faith experience? But yeah, I think yeah. you've really explained yeah, that. You know, yeah. that the numbers and what stage of life. Mm. You know, you were deciding. What to do next in life? Mm. Sebab baru bekerja kan yes, masa yes, itu. So I want to ask you the next question, which is, ada apa apa yang cerita yang uh, very interesting, right? Mm. Yang uh, when it comes to the journey of writing this song, anything that you can share with us that hey, you know, I bet you didn't know about this, but during the process of writing, this happened, that happened. Is uh, there anything interesting you can share with us? Okay, so uh, a few stories, like maybe one or two. Sure. Okay. Uh, I've wrote some songs. Saya ada tulis beberapa lagu. Mm. Tapi yang kekal ini lagu yang like senang saya tulis. It's like the words are flowing. Mm. The the perkataan tu senang saya tulis. Sebab I think it's coming from you know uh, Roh Kudus. Roh Kudus. Yes. Yeah, coming from the Bible itself. Yes. And then uh, I think this song is one of the song that I have like uh, enjoy doing it. Not so much like. Uh, stress. Stress. Atau, mm. I need to go to other room to find inspiration. I need to go healing to get some words. Tak tak perlu. So mm. uh, that's one of it. Interesting. And then uh, second is uh, this is in my church. Mm. What apa yang kami practice is when we have a song, we don't say that it's it's only your song. We mm. will share with others. And then what happen? We will have something like this. Come together. Mm. Okay. Uh, look at this lyrics. Is it okay? Mm. Is it not? And uh, that's the most special thing about. Uh, our church and songwriting mm. bagi saya bila gereja membantu or gereja like uh, helping you out the song um, have more meaning mm. because at the end of the day it, uh, lagu itu kita mau dinyanyikan di gereja yeah. it's not like my personal song to god the song is god's one it's yeah. not it's not for me i just like uh, diberikan position untuk itu saya just borrow mm. dipinjamkan mm. okay and then uh, di sana saya Berdapat bekerjasama dengan beberapa producer yeah, yeah, dari Indonesia. Mm. Uh, shout out to Herman Suryanto mm-hmm. Halim. Mm. Shout out to Stanley Manohutu as well. Mm-hmm. And they really help in terms of production, mm. recording, mixing, mm. mastering and on lah. So uh, kita dapat ni connection juga yeah. dengan Indonesia. And then um, again, like apa yang kita cerita tadi yes. for your podcast as, mm. as well. When God provide, He really provide. Yes, amen. Like for me, in in million, uh, you know, in million dreams, I didn't know I could collab with Indonesian mm. people. That as we speaking now, they are quite good in worship songs. Yes, yeah. Betul. So, wow. When when God provide, He really provides. Wow, That's the thing. I yeah. love it, Rio. <laughs> Fantastic. Yeah. Now I, I'm very interested to know it. Because anda cakap tadi kan sebab penulisan lagu ini seperti uh, amat senang, senang you know, just yeah, flowing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you know, I want to ask you, berapa proses lama ni? Berapa lama dari uh, inception kan? Uh, masa kamu uh, mendengar uh, uh, bilangan do, uh, okay, chapter yeah. 6 yeah. ayat 20 and from that point until lagu dihabiskan berapa lama prosesnya? Sebab mm. some songwriters mereka ambil setahun juga uh, ada. Uh, saya uh, pernah uh, dengar, you know, uh, satu satu malam sudah semua ni. <laughs> 
yeah. So untuk yang ke berapa lama sebenarnya prosesnya? I think saya if saya tak silap lah, hmm. it's actually tak sampai seminggu. Oh. Tapi not including production lah. Yes, the, yes, the, yes. the song hmm. finish, hmm. but there's a Uh, kami buat perubahan sedikit di chorus mm. and then I remember we gather at church lepas tu uh, my pastor Pastor Perry just mm. like okay lah like what we can do for the chorus and then on the spot chorus dapat di sana juga Fua. macam tu lah so we, I have a chorus but I like uh, saya mau like ubah sedikit so mm. ubah sedikit and then dapat di sana so I think less than a week the the song boleh yang, ma- yang mana datang dulu uh, mm. perkataannya uh, ataupun melodinya datang dulu okay. atau dua-dua sama sama kalau saya hmm. in this song hmm. of course the perkataan dulu hmm. lingers in my mind is like uh, Tuhan menyinari wajahnya kepada hmm. saya and then I'm a type of a songwriter I like melody first hmm. so I don't know if I can share this but I listen to like so many hmm. music uh, so many different, songs different, different genre, different genre. Yeah. and then uh, I think these are tips lah basically yes. so if you want like to have a melody hmm. faster it's not by Uh, keep silence and don't listen to music. Kamu perlu dengar banyak mm. music, and then you took a bit part of this. This one I like this one, and then mm. it become your it become your own songwriting. Like it become your own song. Mm. Macam tu. So uh, during that time, uh, you know Spectra, Spectral, Alan Alan Walker, Spectral. Alan Walker, yes, yeah. Alan Walker, yeah. I I heard the progression. Oh, bagus nih. Then I put. Wow. <laughs> okay lah. Disclaimer. Yes. Okay. Yes. I love it. Yeah. Something like this lah. Because wow. I'm a music. I like music. Yeah. I listen to music. I listen so many types of music. So I, this is my way of doing. Fantastic. Yeah. And you see how the Lord can use so many different yeah, yeah, yeah. sources to yes. beri kamu inspirasi. Yeah. Correct. Now I know this is a little bit. This question mungkin sedikit bias sikit mm-hmm. sebab kan you know anda yang tulisnya <laughs> dan melodinya dari anda juga dari Tuhan tapi yeah. melalui kamu but is there like a, a like a maybe a favorite part of the song yang kamu yang kegemaran anda mungkin oh. versi ni verse verse or chorus ni atau bridge oh, okay. yeah bagi saya the, the the very like spoke to me yang saya mm. sangat suka is the verse two mm. uh, and I remember during recording I I sing my heart Uh, you know how hard loud mm. yang dia berkata ku berserah pada panggilanmu ini jiwa dan hatiku ku abadikan segalanya kau yang kekal untuk selamanya so it's like i just want to surrender my life to the one that is forever yang yang, yang tidak tidak constrained dengan masa mm. tidak 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 dengan masa dia ada untuk sampai bila-bila so when i do that uh, my life is like secure I don't need to think about so many things. I cannot. I don't need to complicate because I'm doing this for yang seorang pribadi yang kekal macam tu. So uh, itu really spoke to my heart. Wow. Yeah. Rio, before I let you go, <laughs> yeah. Um, you know, apakah harapan anda untuk yang kekal? Sebab you know after this song goes out, I'm sure mm. a lot of churches also want mm. to sing this song. Mm. You know, it's a local song. It's it's a beautiful song as well. It's a very uplifting song as well. Mm. Uh, so what is your harapan untuk yang kekal? Untuk negara, untuk uh, you know gereja gereja yang lain, untuk mm. walaupun individu yang akan main dengan nyanyi lagu ini. Mm. Okay, for this song yang kekal, uh, if you don't know who's the songwriter, it's okay. As long as kamu boleh terhubung, you mm. can connect with the song, you understand the meaning behind the song, and you sing it to God. And then for me, that's really uh, what saya punya harapan lah. Yeah. Because I I I firmly believe that. Uh, whatever we have in this world itu kita dipinjamkan saja bukan kita kalau if like one day we we pass away mm. kita mati bukan kita boleh bawa pun yeah. my song cannot give talk, took me you know together to with me yeah. to the heaven yeah. but uh, I, I think it's a God song mm. so yeah have fun singing it you know enjoy it mm. and uh, you know let's God be the glory lah. Wow. Let, uh, God uh, be the glory yes. of, of Amen. Thank you so much, Rio. Okay. Thank you so much for coming here. Thank That you. was, I know, really from your heart. Then uh, I want to say on behalf of the team, you know, berterima kasih kerana sudi datang sebab saya tahu hari ini juga his his wedding anniversary with his wife, yeah. and he's still here to serve God by singing Yang Kekal. <laughs> so after this, I hope you have a wonderful time with your wife. Yes. Thank you. Yes. 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 Thank you very much. Yeah. And uh, hey, to the rest of you guys, you know, if you guys really enjoyed this song Yang Kekal, please make sure you guys. Uh, 
uh, support BWCC as well. This is not the only song. They have mm. written three or four albums. Yeah. And uh, they got a new single coming out very, very soon as yeah. well. Yes. Yeah, next month, soon. if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Next month in the process. Yes. Yeah. So make sure you guys look up for BWCC. You can just search BWCC on YouTube and then you the sounds from there and if you love listening to other songs as well you can also subscribe to us uh, Let's Get Real Malaysia you, uh, we have other uh, episodes that we covered on and cover as well different different songs from different different churches and artists as well so make sure you guys subscribe to us you can also follow us on other social media platforms you can follow us on Instagram uh, we have TikTok now as well also like us on Facebook and of course we're all streaming we're streaming on all major platforms including Spotify, Google Podcasts Apple Podcasts and if you are looking for a community you can join us on Discord as well that's where we are description link in the description box below what's in the description box below as well is the link to the song sheet and the chords to the, uh, to the song Yang Kakao so make sure you guys head on over there and you can sing this song in your CF in your CG in your churches especially and let's bring Yang Kakao and make it Kakao yeah, there yeah, we go, ladies yeah. and gentlemen. <laughs> thank you very much, Rio. Thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you guys for watching Uncover. This yeah. has been myself, Rio, and uh, the song Young Kakao. We'll see you guys again next time. God bless you. Bye-bye. Bye. God bless. Hey guys, thanks for watching another episode of Let's Get Real. We hope you enjoyed watching this episode and if you have, what are you waiting for? Make sure you share it with all your friends. And hey, if you wish to contribute to our show, you can send over your love gift to the bank details below. Just do us a favour and earmark LGR so that we know your giving will be used for the show. And with that, take care and God bless. Bye!